Hey everyone, Mike here from The Art of Guitar. Today, once again, we're doing Art of Drums. And I realized a short while ago that I do have like this bucket list that's in my head of all these things I've always wanted to learn. And one of them is the intro to Some Like It Hot by The Power Station. Now you guys probably know the singer Robert Palmer for his biggest hit, which was Addicted to Love. You know, that video with all those pale model girls dancing. But a year before that hit song came out, he was in the band The Power Station. I always thought it was Power Station, so it was weird today I learned it's The Power Station. Anyway, the intro has always intrigued me and my friends. I remember talking to my other drummer friends and they always tried to learn that intro, but we could never get it to sound right. <laughs> That's because there are some studio tricks going on. There's some massive compression happening on the full drum kit. Uh, the room mics are really turned up loud, so you hear a lot of room sound. And then there's a gate added to it. The gate will shut the sound off when it hits a certain volume. So you're going to hear when I kick into this intro that when something is being held out, all of a sudden it just cuts off. And that's what adds to the mysterious sound of this intro that we couldn't figure out back in the day. So I spent a few hours learning it. I spent more time trying to get it to sound right in the studio during post-production. Oh, and the original drummer who recorded this in the studio was Tony Thompson. So I wanted to make sure to mention that. Okay, so I just wanted to give you that quick intro. Uh, let's give it a try. Thanks for watching.